Braun from Milwaukee, Wisconsin, where I'm privileged to teach music theory and arranging at Concordia University, Wisconsin. I'm excited to speak with you today about the three volume collection of SAB chorales by Michael Pretorius that Concordia published last year. Pretorius was an extremely prolific composer, creating a vast array of settings based around the Lutheran chorale. These settings vary from simple two-part pieces to elaborate four-choir pieces using voice and instruments in the polychoral tradition. Out of the 1,200 plus choral arrangements based on the Lutheran chorale, 125 of these exist as tricinium. I want to introduce you today to two SAB chorale settings by Michael Pretorius that use the original text and tune of Martin Luther. These two chorales are appropriate for any use in a service during the church year, but are especially fitting for Reformation celebrations. And these two chorales are, Lord, keep us steadfast in your word, and a mighty fortress is our God. These chorale settings employ many compositional techniques, but are largely counterpartly derived, with the chorale tune often stated completely in one of the voices. The choir could sing the complete setting by itself as its contribution to the service, or could sing these verses in alternatum with the congregation. As a conductor and performer, Pretorius gave many detailed suggestions that are still useful today for creating variety with the use of the chorale, adapting whatever resources are available. With that in mind, these settings may be performed with voice alone, but can be easily performed with instruments taking over some of the vocal lines. Pretorius often suggested adapting his settings in this way, but always insisted at least one voice carry the text so that the word of God could be proclaimed and heard. Pretorius had a tremendous impact on Lutheran church music at the beginning of the 17th century, and his contributions are still very useful today in the church music of the 21st century. Mm -hmm. 